I did it, I already did it, I already did it. <gasps> my DM's gonna crash, my DM's gonna crash. Oh my god! So hello guys, my name is Sola and I'm back with another Minecraft video guys. So today I want to be doing a coding video. So today I want to be teaching you the build a room program. You can build a room. So there'll be a link down in the description on how to download the code. Please like and subscribe and let's get straight into it. When you build a room, each uh, side of the rectangle or square will be one block shorter. Because when you make a wall, it'll be four blocks. But when you make a room, it'll have to be three blocks. You have to account for the next length, which is four. But when you build a regular wall, it'll be five. To make build room work, you need to edit the hair program. So double hyphens just mean that it's just a note. It doesn't make the total do anything, but let's just read it anyway. Double hyphen build room constructs four walls and a ceiling. Function the build room length, width, height, if hill dot count inventory length minus one times height times two plus width minus one times height times two, then and return false. That means not enough blocks and it'll end. Double hyphen build the four walls. Build wall length minus one height. Total dot turn white. Build wall width minus one height. So that turn white. So it just means that it'll make a length of four turn white, and then just do the same thing. Okay. So width minus one height, build wall length minus one height. Total dot turn white, build wall width minus height. Total dot turn white. We turn true and and well, that's it. So let's start. Build the room of four walls. So always start load ABI hill. So it loads up hill. Double hyphen handle command line arguments. Local clear is equal something. So that's just like length, width, and height. It just stores it. So if you put in a clear args one equals seven, then the length equals seven. So clear args can be like anything, I guess. So local length equals two number clear args one. Local width equals two number clear args one. Local height equals two number clear args one. If length equals new, so length equals zero, or width equals new, or width equals zero, or height equals new, and height equals zero, then we'll say usage, build room, length, width, and height. And we turn, and it'll end, and it'll put in building. If hill dot build room, length, width, and height equal equal false, that means that error, not enough blocks, and the world is not enough blocks. But if that doesn't happen, and it'll print done, and it's finished. Okay, so let's demonstrate. There is no coding video without a demonstration. So let's make a small room, a build room, one, three, two, okay? Let's watch. So it's making a room, guys. Okay. So yeah, I just hope you can like, look at how it's moving and that. So this is what the total made. But now this is the most exciting part. Let's make a huge one. Okay guys, let's make uh, the big one. Look at that. And you know what's gonna happen, guys. <laughs> okay, build room, 16, 16, 16. Let's go, boys. If you don't like this video, I don't, I'm not gonna have a happy day. So please smash that like button because I'm gonna explode all this, okay? Let's do it. 